Hi, I'm Georgie Wood, Field Technical Manager, and we're here at Arbarton Blackgrass Innovation Centre. In our first grass weeds episode, we looked at how cultivation moves blackgrass seed through the soil profile using the rice test. Using rice, we demonstrated how direct drilling leaves blackgrass seed on the surface, whereas minimum tillage distributes the blackgrass seed throughout the profile. Ploughing, however, buries that seed to the plough depth. Over the last four years, we've been looking at how different combinations of cultivations over the seasons impact on the levels of blackgrass control. In order to do this, we've created a cultivation matrix whereby we've overlaid the different cultivations throughout the different seasons. Our first three years were a winter cropping situation with winter wheat. However, in the fourth year, we were forced into a spring cropping situation and have drilled spring wheat instead. So our results from the first three years showed that minimum tillage gave the highest levels of seed return and the worst levels of black grass control. The plot that we're in now has been continuous min tilled for all four years and you can see that actually the establishment here is quite good, however there is some black grass to be seen in this plot. And just next door we have the plot where we had three years of min till followed by direct drilling in this season. You can see that the crop establishment is much more challenging and also we have much more black grass because of that, with in excess of 50 heads per metre squared. It's then interesting to see where we achieved the best black grass control in this plot last year, which we've divided up again into a plough and direct drill. The crop establishment is much better in the plough and much more challenging in the direct drilling where there's much more trash on the surface. Because of that, we've seen more black grass coming through in the direct drilling and less in the plough, where there's more crop competition. However, we know it's not all about black grass control. We've also looked at which combination of cultivations gave the best margin. For each of the first three years, that was direct drilling. However, the continuous direct drilling plot did not deliver the best margin overall. This plot has been direct drilled in all four years and as you can see, we have a fairly thin crop and a very high level of black grass. We'll have to wait for harvest to see whether the yield in this plot is impacted by the black grass enough to offset the cost of ploughing. We'll update with those results towards the end of the year, but in the meantime, why not check out more information at syngenta.co.uk.